Okay, so as promised last week, um, I'm gonna actually inject the uh, tracer die. Here's the product. It's actually made in Italy, I believe, this particular brand. Um, I've got like two ounces loaded into the dispenser. Uh, you can put this in when the system is fully pressurized, which I intend to do. The system is fully pressurized. Uh, you can put it in the low side, of course, with the coupling. And uh, this particular kit actually comes with a low side coupling for uh, YF 1234 refrigerant as well, which is nice. So you can use it for both. It's, uh, it is a product that can be used with both refrigerants as well as hybrid, uh, which of course the compressors are high voltage electric, so it's, it's usable for that as well. Plenty of rags when you're actually loading this because of course you have to bleed the air, which means with this coupling off you can depress the shredder and you have to fill the tube and bleed the air. So until of course the product comes up, you, want, you don't want to be injecting air into the system. That would defeat the purpose of course, right? So uh, yeah, so we'll hook this up to the low side. Inject just a quarter inch. I will show you that from the company's website. And uh, yeah, we'll run the vehicle and uh, see if we can actually see any, because uh, we know for a fact that it is leaking. The question is at what rate? Uh, that's the only uh, unknown at this point. Uh, product comes with the stickers. Let the next guy go that know that a UV dye has already been added. So of course with gloves and your safety specs, the low side fitting. So just remove the cap on the low side fitting. I could hear that there for a second. <laughs> I can't. Just clean the fitting. Otherwise, you're going to end up bitching the old rings that are inside the fitting, of course. There's a bunch of filth in your schmutz. So keep in mind, this could be pressurized slightly. Hold the backside of the line and hold the rag in situ as well if you can, best you can, because it could actually. You don't want it would defeat the purpose if you let the, the tracer die kind of spray all over the place, then you'll have false positives on the, the trace, right? Okay, so all I'm gonna do is actually you can see the graduated scale here. I'm gonna try and push. See my mirror moving there? Can you see that yellow tracer around that line? That's the liquid line in the bottom of the condenser. That looks suspect to me. I'm gonna keep an eye on that. Again, just to reiterate, uh, things went much better when I actually started the AC system. Of course, the suction line went into a relative vacuum, not a vacuum, of course, but the, basically the pressure lowered and it wasn't bleeding as bad and I was able, I was able to inject uh, the quarter ounce, it's just like a, uh, micrometer of course right you know you use the scale and you, you dial up to get your your quarter ounce but I'm telling you this is astounding the the brilliance of this product it, <laughs> no no pun intended it's well named uh, the, it's amazing the actual amount of light that it actually reflects it's incredible like I was really pleased with that product guys uh, you might want to check it out and it's, it's not expensive as I said I think it was $30 and it's That'll last me a lifetime. Right, I'll leave it at that. Cheers.